take these two sentences, 하는 거예요, or in casual speech, 하는 거야, and just the sentence 해요, or in casual speech, just 해. Both of them mean the present tense of the verb 하다, to do. So, I do it, or 해요, I do it. What's the difference? So, both of these have the exact same meaning and they both come from the verb 하다, but they do have slightly different nuances when you use them. The quick answer is, using simply the yo form, or just hey without the yo, very slightly more emphasizes the verb that you are using. So let's take a look at these two sentences. We have 저는 피자를 먹어요, and 저는 피자를 먹는 거예요. Again, both of these have the exact same literal meaning. I eat pizza. Their nuance is slightly different. So using just the yo form, or bogo if you're speaking casually, slightly emphasizes the verb. So it slightly would sound like this. I eat pizza. Nin koyo or nin koya, or any variation on that, however, slightly emphasizes the subject of that verb. So in this case, the subject of the verb is whoever or whatever is doing that verb, if it's an action verb, or if it's a descriptive verb, whatever it is that's being described by that descriptive verb. In this case, it's mokta, to eat. So whoever or whatever is the subject of this verb. In that case, whoever it is that's eating it, which is me. So this sentence would sound more like, I eat the pizza. And this difference is actually not as pronounced as I'm making it sound. I'm just illustrating it to you so you can tell the difference. The actual difference is more of just a feeling, how Koreans would feel when they hear this sentence versus this sentence. Note that this nin ko or nin ko shida literally means it is a thing called that does some sort of verb. For example, you could say something like mur, water, murun, mashinen, drinking, mashinen goeo. Water is a thing that you drink. It's simply using this call thing to describe water. So water literally is a thing that you drink. Or another example would be this sentence. 그건, as for that thing, 제가 좋아하는 거예요. As for that thing, well, that's a thing that I like. So 그건 제가 좋아하는 거예요. That is a thing that I like. So then which one do you use? Do you use the regular you form or do you use nun koyo? Well, it's up to you. Whether you want to emphasize one or the other isn't really that big of a deal. Just pick whichever one you feel like. This difference between the nun ko or nun ko and the regular you form or regular present tense extends past the present tense. In fact, it also goes into past tense and future tense. So for the past tense, you can have a conjugation of un or a nian after a verb stem and the future tense or just a lir. And this difference between un and nian in the past tense and the regular past tense, something hesoyo, for example, is the same difference. Or hagesunida. I'll just write hageso yo to be short here. The difference between the regular past tense with hesoyo and this ko form that we've just gone over for present tense is also the same. So using the yo form slightly emphasizes the verb. So if you were to say hesoyo, that means I did it with emphasis on the verb here, hada. And if you were to say tega han, using the past tense, koeo, that would mean more like I did it in the past tense. So there are two forms for the past tense as well as two forms for the future tense and two forms for the present tense. And another example would be tega hal koeo, I will do it, versus tega hagesunida or hagesoyo or whatever form that you're using there. This also has slightly more emphasis on I. I will do it. 제가 할 거예요. Versus 제가 하겠습니다. Or whatever verb you want to do, which would be more emphasis on the verb. I will do it. Again, this difference is very small, so don't stress about it. One more thing is that when you're asking a question, there is another slight difference between using this nun called form or just using the regular yo form. So you can ask someone 뭐 하는 거예요? What are you doing? Or you can just ask them of these two, the nun ko form sounds slightly more aggressive. It doesn't necessarily mean one is rude and one is polite, but just something to pay attention to. Any other examples of these two being different that I didn't note? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Also, thanks to my Patreon supporters and my YouTube supporters. 그럼 다음에 또 봐.